We have Shariman Bazaar, Immortal Bastion, and God Willow's Grove. I want to actually go for Immortal Bastion here. But of course, while we're getting through the boring stuff, if you're new to the channel, welcome, I'm Mighty. And if you're a returning viewer, I always appreciate it. So make sure to sub so you can catch my daily content. We did end up on Immortal Bastion. And I'm still playing Lee Sin. I hope it's not a prismatic game. Ooh, starting with Kale? I don't think Kale reroll is anywhere near as good. What I really want to try is Cho reroll. That's why I'm playing Lee Sin right now, is I really just want to play Cho. Early Echo and Callista. That's pretty good. I also have a really weird board that does have Callista in it that I want to try out at some point. I'm going to buy Viego and Mal's here. I have Shadow Isles if I want it. I do think I'm going to sell the Echo to hit this cast three, or cast two, of course. Barring I don't get any gold. All right, I'm not going to. I will take a Gargoyles this early, though. I think I'm definitely supposed to buy Renekton here for Shuriman possibility. Technically, I found out that my highest win streak overall is just Shuriman. And then I think I'm just going to take Mal's pair. Seer is fine. That makes me want to lean towards like Invokers or something. Be gold. I'll just take Trade Sector. Slayer Emblem's interesting, but Slayer's got Mega nerfed. We're going with this. There's my Cho. I still really just want to do it. See what happens when you force Cho reroll. I'm kind of down for it, honestly. Cho should definitely be in. But yeah, I think I'm just going to try and force Cho Mal's reroll and see what happens. And I'll slam a Gargoyles. Hopefully I win this. I think I should. Hello! I have a cat on me now. I did not expect you to jump up like that. That is the first time she has done that. Uh, yeah, yeah, you are in my lap. Oh, now there's just a cattail in my camera. Hopefully she doesn't try and stand in front of me the entire time. I guess I don't want to hold this three if I'm trying this. I just want to hold ones. I just accidentally... Okay, well, I guess now we're karma, right? Hello, one second, please back up. All right, get down, big girl. Yeah, the, uh, I accidentally leveled because she put my hand down on F. So now I feel like I should just play Karma. And I have zero games with Karma. But they just nerfed it because this is the B patch. Yeah, this is the B patch. It looks like it's not that good. If I hit a bunch, I'll still go for Renekton, but it's not very likely. Apparently I should have went for Jinx. Second Karma. I think that kind of, no. That kind of commits me. And we have Karma Pair this early. That's just very good. I should find a way to hit gold here. I'm going to throw this here and then sell, sell. Like that. Hits in. This would have been an insane start in the last patch. What do I want? What's our best in slot items? JG, probably as one of the items for sure. So I want, oh, that would have been insane. Glove on karma. I'll take a rod. Hopefully that guy doesn't have any karmas. No, okay. Yeah, I would have had a karma two at two five. I think I'm supposed to take Cass here and level. That's just Velkaz, right? Just Velkaz and then place like this. Hope for the best. I should sell this by a show. Okay. Archangels is actually one of our best in slots, apparently, for karma. I did not realize that. I guess we could try and get another cast, but I don't think it's actually worth it. Cast isn't great. I don't know what the rise does on this or in this region either. So I'll take a two unit loss. Well, there's my new cast and a Tarek. I mean, I definitely want Tarek. I can do this and then sell this off. Wrong one. I actually think I'm supposed to hit 20 here if I win. So I'll sell both of these to hit 20. There is also an Akshan here, but Akshan's bad with these items. We do get a win, so I sell these. That is Ravenous Hunter, by the way. I will buy everything and then take my free roll and miss. I should have been playing Void at this point. Isn't there cast two, I guess? I can hold a Rek'Sai. Archangels is a fine Kai'Sa item, so maybe I should still hold my Void units. 
Just in case. Bow? Give me a sword. Remover and gold. Now I feel like I shouldn't hold it. Okay, yeah. I'm going to sell this. We also got a champion duplicator, which is a big deal. I can slam belts if I want. There's another Rek'Sai, but there's also Soraka. Galio pair. I think I'm supposed to do this now. I can put items on Taric, but I think it's actually not that good. You'd rather have them on Shin. I'm still going to do it, though, to try and win, of course. Sell off this, sell off this, and hit 40. Oh, are there two? There are two ravenous players, huh? Yeah, there are two. Let's look around real quick. Ionian, cut above, Pandora's items, Demon Flare, Ravenous, Ravenous. Yep. All right. I don't think I'm taking Training Reward this time, though it is prismatic. I'm going to start here. Thieves Gloves isn't good. Double Trouble. Could I double trouble Karma? Let's reroll this. This one's fine. It's probably just this. I'm nowhere near on Karma, so I'll take that. I could also, if I wanted to, go ahead and two-star the Karma. A lot of people rolled there. I probably should level and roll. At this point, I'm actually kind of okay with lose streaking if it's not terrible. Like, if I don't take a whole bunch of damage. I feel like I should lose to this guy. I'm not going to. Okay. Yeah, apparently this start is just very, very strong. I'll buy a three just in case. There's my Galio too. Nasus? Nasus isn't good here, really. I do definitely level now, though. I could add that in. I don't think that's it either. I'm one off Karma. I'm going to roll a little. Let's throw it in his ear for now. I'm not going to roll below 30, though. What do I want a Carousel? Probably... Sword, I would think. Also, Nasus was probably better than Azir here in hindsight, just because my front line's the weak part right now. Anyone else playing invokers, or is it just me? This guy's also playing invokers, and he didn't roll. I definitely just want this sword. If I don't get the sword, it's glove. If I don't get that, it's rod. I guess I'm taking a rod. Yeah, so I'm also contested. I'm going to be fighting here, but I have a way better start for it. So maybe he pivots. There's another Galio. Also another Terig. I'm only at 38. I could have also went for armor there, but I think it's more important to get three items on Karma. Oh, I definitely missed there. I should swap this Azir out. This Azir should not be in the comp right now. And this is the guy who's contesting me. He did roll some, it looks like. He also, he hit Shin. So now he is in a way better spot than he was in earlier. There's my Karma and nothing else. All right, so what do we want to put in here? Bastion, Sork, Demacia. It's really just Bastion or Sork. I'll just throw another one in for now. Also, I can only have 48 here and 69. Nice. I wonder if this combat start trigger actually still happens. Also, if I see an Aphelios, I should probably grab it just in case. There's a Liss and a Swain. Do we want Swain? Not really. It's just Shen Ari. We just need to level and look for Shin Ari here. I'll hold threes as much as I can. Cloak, glove. Okay, that's JG. Missed on everything there. Definitely just supposed to go ahead and level. Run a Swain and drop my JG. I can build a Zephyr. I don't want to just yet though. My plan now is just to econ back up until I hit 50 and then go from there. Is it Giant Slayer as the last item, or is it Gunblade? I feel like either's probably fine. 
Yeah, either's fine. Let's hold threes. Should probably hold twos over ones as well. Freak em Bob. That's not it. I don't want any of this. I guess I can do the randomizer from Pandora's Bench, and it's fine. Uh, well, and then I immediately just hit Giant Slayer. It's also a Galio. We are going to end up three-starring this Galio, it looks like. I could take this off, but I don't actually want to. Yeah, let's just focus on trying to get our Karma 3. This guy is rolling at 6. I should move Galio out front once he gets to 3-star and then put the Gargoyles onto him, I think. That seems like it's going to be way better. Also, I might just have to roll down. I think I am supposed to roll. There's a Shin. Now we have six Invokers. Okay, that should be a pretty big buff. I still have multiple upgrades I can hit, though. There's Soraka. Maybe now I chill. I don't want this rod. I think I want it to be armor. Build a Sunfire Cape. Oh, she all, okay, there we go. I was like, she almost went after. I think I definitely need to hit three-star karma. And this guy's also... Well, he still has, he doesn't even have a two-star. Rise? I have second pick, though. He gets Rise. That's so sad. I guess I take Ari. All right, well, now I guess I take a Shin. The item doesn't matter. I need to swap these two spots as well. Why does she still have items? I hope it's not bugged. Is it like giving me one item? Okay, it's not. Swap these two. Drop the armor here. What are we building after that? Is it just more? I guess it could be, it looks like it's Guardbreaker Soraka. So that's what I'm gonna go with. Or Gunblade. If it's, Gunblade's a possibility here, I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on list. And I don't care about this three star at this point. It's not worth losing out on that much gold. This is the other Ravenous player. And we do beat them. The question is, do we just roll until we hit this Karma? We're one off Shin, one off Taric. I can probably chill. Now we're, now we're one off Galio. Okay, well, we can just hit Galio for free. Now we definitely do this. Swap all the items over to Galio. I think we should be strong enough to level, but Karma 3 is a really big deal. This guy just has Karma 2. Are there any other Invoker players? No. Okay. Is this guy playing Karma? No. Oh, we're just not dealing enough damage. What is this? Oh, wait, what? Is there some kind of a bug going on here? How did he have all those items? He doesn't have them anymore. Is there a bug? That was weird. If I'm leveling, what am I adding in? O obviously, Ari would be the best possible, but that's probably not happening. Rod? Oh, there's a Karma? All right, let's go ahead and build a Gunblade. Drop an armor here. And I think we're supposed to roll another Taric. Felios is also fine to throw in. Maybe that's who I should be trying to throw in. There's finally another Karma. We need two more though. Really? I didn't hit the Karma. Also, this could have been a death blade, but I don't think that's actually good here. Ionic spark or and actually it's just another gargoyles. There's Shin too. Where is this guy at on his karmas? He did try and level. I'm gonna swap a little bit here. This is the wind streaker. Hopefully double gargoyles makes the difference. And I guess we look for tier here, right? We just put a tier somewhere for earlier cast probably on cast just to make sure she isn't getting the temporary item oh is this a win 
It is. We beat the wind streaker. There's a, okay, now I'm supposed to roll for sure. Because I'm one off. There she is. Bang, karma three. And cast comes out if I find a rise, but now we're just trying to hit level eight. And this is after the nerf. Before the nerf, it was just absolutely uh, stupid is the correct answer. And it looks like they might still be playable after the nerf. This lobby's super close though. Another rise, but I, there's no way I get it because the other guy's still alive, this guy. He's just gonna take the rise. I'll take, well, no, he's gonna take Thieves Gloves. Yeah. I'll take the rise. Yoink. Yeah, nobody should let him get a Thieves Gloves there. He's playing Lucky Gloves and he has three Thieves Gloves. I wanted this specifically just so I could do this. I should put him out in the front at this point. Do like this. I'm gonna swap sides. I'm gonna fake swap. I changed my mind. Uh, Sunfire, I guess I throw here. I'll just throw another belt. And I am going to sell everything here. All right, is Karma 3 enough of a difference here? That's the real question. To beat the Triple Thieves Gloves. I am just his comp, but with the better version of the units, he has the better items because he has Thieves Gloves. And it looks like I do get a win here. Okay, we're definitely just chilling. We have to just chill and try and level. If we find Ari, we're in an insane spot because that gives us Ionian and Sork. I guess I could hold Yasuo or Set. I'm going to hold a Yasuo for now. I'm trying to fake move my opponents out. This should definitely be a win. This guy does not look like he's strong enough to beat the six Sork board, especially since I have the Karma 3. After this, I'm going to check just to see how much damage she does in this fight. Um, a lot. 9,000. All right, we're top four now. Top four and our other player that's playing it is almost out. We can level after this and then we add in just Yasuo for now. All right, now that they know that I'm going to try and fake move every time, I'm actually going to move now. Never let them know your next move. What is this? Ionic Spark or Gunblade or Shroud? I think it's Shroud. Throw in Yasuo, add in Ionian. I didn't actually move. I'm gonna hold this since I didn't actually move. I'll hold it for next turn. There's no point in me using it. It would just hit karma. But I need to move around to try and make it as good as possible. And it's just the two invoker players left in the top two. There's Yasuo too, I guess I take that. At the least, I should be doing something like this. He doesn't have a shroud. I'm gonna fake move again and then just put this here. Oh, I forgot it changes. I forgot it changes and left my freaking shroud on the bench. Well, it's all right. We're just gonna kill him here. It's not gonna matter. I have the Karma 3. He can't beat the Karma 3, right? Oh, he can. Is it gonna kill me? No. All right, well, if I hit... Okay, I didn't hit. How do I make this better? Also, he just has so many items. I'm gonna move this, do this, this. Put him on the same side. If I had a shroud, I'd be in a way better spot here, by the way. But I wanted him to make sure he's targeting Galio first. Okay, well, no, it's still a loss. All right, well, I'll take a second. I mean, he had two billion items. But if you enjoyed watching the video, make sure to let me know down below.